Hi, my name is Eleni and I'll tackle about combined variation. What is combined variation? Combined variation describes a situation where a variable depends on two or more other variables and varies directly with some of them and varies inversely with others. But how can you determine the formula of the equation? All you have to do is Analyze the problem properly, and you'll be able to determine the formula of the equation. When it says directly, it means x is equal to ky. You multiply k to y. When it says jointly, it's the same as directly, but have more variables. When it says inversely, it means division, wherein you'll divide k and y, since it's k over y. For example, if x varies directly as y and inversely as z, and x is equal to 10 when y is equal to 5 and z is equal to 3, for what value of z will x is equal to 3 and y is equal to 4? Since it says x varies directly as y, it'll be x is equal to ky. But it also says inversely as z, so it'll be x is equal to ky over z. Then next is we substitute the numbers 10 is equal to k parenthesis 5 over 3. Next is uh, we solve it by doing a cross multiplication. Now in doing the cross multiplication, it'll be 10 over 1 equals to k5 over 3. Multiply it, 10 times 3 is equal to 30 and 1 times 5 is equal to 5. Therefore, the answer will be 30 equals to k5. To let k stand alone, you'll have to cancel out 5. But the question is, how do you cancel out 5? It's very simple. All you have to do is divide by itself in both sides. Then, 30 divided by 5 is equals to 6. The value of k is 6. Now, to find z when y is equal to 4 and x is equal to 3, all you have to do is substitute. The formula will be z is equal to ky over x since we're finding z. Then substitute uh, z is equal to 6, 4 over 3. Now, uh, 6 times 4 is equal to 24 over 3. And 24 divided by 3 is equal to 8. Therefore, the value of z is 8. And that's our final answer. It's very simple and very easy to understand. That's all for today. Thank you for listening and have a nice day.